on time, then give me your love. Guys, look, look who it is, y'all. Look at that, y'all. Look at this guy, guys. Look at him. Look at him. Look at this guy. Yo, who is this guy, yo? <laughs> Who's this fish? This guy's a fish, guys. <laughs> Oh, me, my, me, my homie Yo, Roger. Look at this guy. I'm on a charge camera today. Ah, it's crazy. <laughs> what do you say, fam? You good? Yeah, it's not too. Yo, look at this guy, yo. Yo, let me do your intro for you. <laughs> Who's this guy? <laughs> All right. Yo, What's up, YouTube? Shingy. It's your boy Shingy, Anyways. as usual. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yo. Oh yeah. So guys, so guys, um, we got a quick little shoot today that we're gonna be doing. We're gonna do two shoots actually. I'm gonna just warm up, just chill around, just take a bunch of for like the first row, and it's gonna be black and white. And then after that, we're gonna shoot Marcus for way better coat, which is pretty dope. We have a new jacket. I don't have it right now, but like I'll show you guys. And the most interesting thing about it is that I'm gonna use the Mamiya RZ67, which is crazy because you know how I feel about the RZ67. <laughs> <laughs> you guys know the battle between the RZ67 and the RB, so like it's gonna be very interesting to use, and I'll give you guys my thoughts on it. So yeah, maybe it might be a review video, or it just might be like a I'm back shooting video. But yeah, this is my first shoot back after a couple months. So Marcus already shot though that shoot you did with uh you and Roger with Roger. Yeah, that's pretty much it. We're just waiting for one of the homies, and then it's gone time, y'all. Vimmy. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> no, don't hold the bumble clap it's button, gone. man. The thing is gone. Yeah, like that. Oh my god. So, guys, I loaded the whole entire camera and did a whole entire intro. Freaking rookie over here. Idiot rookie over here. I don't like, record. totally recorded like a two second clip. I want to show you guys a clip right now. This is his recording. I'm recording. Like, I loaded the whole entire film. Like, this guy is so dumb. Okay, so guys, I loaded the film with um, some black and white Ultramax. It's already loaded. You guys have already seen so many videos of me loading. What are you doing? What are your thoughts of the camera? The camera's dope. Okay, so that's the thing that I was saying before. Like, the camera's really dope. Like, I really dig the camera because the winding um, part of it is super quick. So, like, I will say... Um, when we're talking about experience and speed, um, I will give it to the RZ. I will give it to that RZ, but it's not solid. It feels like plastic. Do you feel that? No. <laughs> Yo, shut up, bro. Because <laughs> it's your camera. <laughs> yeah, so I loaded with Black and White Ultramax. We're just going to drive around and make some photos. This is just a warm-up, right? Because I haven't shot in a while. Ultramax, warm-up, uh, shooting. I don't have a light meter because I don't have batteries for my light meter. The light meter that I use is, like, super old and the batteries are really hard to get. So I didn't have time to just go, like, to the store and buy batteries. So I'm going to use my phone um, since it's not that, ex that important of a project. So, yeah, other than that... Yeah, you know what the fuck. <laughs> All right, let's go, y'all. Let's go, let's go. So, like, my buddies are uh, in Best Buy right now. They're grabbing some stuff. Light meter app of choice is Lux. I love it because it's super easy, and you can tap to sort of see what uh, exposure you want, and it actually switches between like highlights, shadows, and then it's gonna read differently. And it's super easy. It's pretty much like aperture priority. So since it's dark right now, I want to shoot at a high, high aperture. So we're going to shoot at F8, um, 400 speed film. I'm going to shoot box speed. So let's see. We're going to shoot homie over there right now, actually. So we're going to put it at F11. And Marcus, are you nervous? <laughs> This guy's nervous. <laughs> shaking yo, camera, shaking. This guy, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Do not drop the baby. Yo. All right, bet. So, you know what? I'm going to shoot at aperture 16. Yeah. I'm going to shoot at F16. Let me see what F. Yeah, F16 should be fine. F16 at 400. I haven't, I haven't used this in a while, guys. Jeez. I want to take a photo of that guy standing there by himself. I, that was the first shot ever, yo. <laughs> okay, so I, I'm, I'm, I will say I'm loving the RZ, guys. I'm loving it. Like I'm loving it like crazy right now. But what else are we gonna do? So we're gonna grab out here. I'm gonna take a photo of Rose, my baby, my baby Rosie. So like, why not? Do you compose? Do you compose with the magnifier, or do you like? Um, I usually do. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I, I can't compose without the magnifier. Some people compose, like they actually compose and then they use the magnifier. Like, I, 
can't. Like I can't. You can't. You don't even use a magnifier sometimes. Yeah. You're crazy, bro. <laughs> you actually smoking something. You're actually crazy. All right. So you know what? I kind of like this Jeep right here. So because, so right now because like the light hasn't changed, anything hasn't changed, I don't really need to touch the settings at all. So we're gonna stay at F. Um, maybe I'll take a portrait of Marcus as well while it's just recording. But um, which one? Should I take a photo of Rose? Do it. She's your baby. I hope this is wide enough. Watch. <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> I hope this is wide enough. So. Oh yeah, I forgot to crank it. <laughs> Don't forget to crank ever. Oh, this is a nice one right here. One, two, three. Ah, oh, that is beautiful. <laughs> okay, so like the one crank makes me feel a lot safer. Did you crank it again? You're so annoying. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> this guy's annoying as hell. But like, I'm really loving it so far. Um, some of my buddies that are actually inside, I'm gonna wait for them. I want to take some portraits in black and white so that like, and I like that background. It's simple, it's straightforward, and the darker skin. So like, you know, it's gonna be dope. Yeah, yeah. Let me take a photo of you guys, yo. Portrait. On this wall right here. Yeah, look at these. Look at these goops, guys. Look at them. They're wearing white shoes. Look at them. Look at all of them. Do I even know you guys? Look at this guy. 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 Look Black. <laughs> <laughs> I want to take a couple of uh, portraits of these guys just to test it out, you know. I haven't used the bellows in like forever, in ages, so. Yo, look at this guy. This guy's already looking at this. <laughs> <laughs> what an idiot, bro. <laughs> yo, this guy, yo, this guy's already. <laughs> yo, yo, move right here. I actually like when the shadow's here. So move right there. Uh, walk forward. Come forward a bit. Uh, a little bit, just a little, there you go, like that. Definitely wants to make sure the sun's in his face. Exactly, <laughs> you caught that, eh? There's a split over here and there's another split over there as well. Yeah, so no, like, I'm gonna actually re-meter for this because I want to meter for the highlights. It's not gonna be the same. So it's saying F22 right now, let's try to drop down to F16. It's gonna be super sharp though, like really sharp. So let's see if I still got it, guys. If I still got the, how do you rotate? Oh, does not got it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dope. Oh, that is so sick. That is so, so sick. All right, good. Right there. No, let's get really in there. I want to get that shadow up there as well. So, they lit that one, two, three. Oh, that's fire. That is so fire. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah, that was really good. <laughs> that was really good. That was really good. <laughs> yeah, that was sick. <laughs> I bet. Yo, let me take you by the Jeep, actually, yo. I think your look is gonna look dope by the Jeep. This guy looks more of a Jeeper than I do, eh? Come on, man. Look at this guy. Look at this guy spilling himself, eh? Look at this guy, yo. Oh, this guy's spilling himself, huh? Alright, so welcome to my whip. You feel me? Ah, uh, you don't? <laughs> tell him. Give him a tour. I got, I got Actually, I can't even show y'all, man. It's too, it's too secret, man. Another day, another day. Another day. day. Alright, bet, yo. Let me frame it because I don't know how the frame is going to look. Haha, right. <laughs> I didn't crank it. <laughs> you know, it scares me, dude, when, it, when I have to, like, you know that little hump? Mm -hmm. It's scary. Like, I feel like I'm breaking it. You know what? Move closer to the window. Yeah. Actually, closer to here. Actually, we'll come back here. Tell me again, Alex. <laughs> actually, come inside. Yeah. <laughs> you want to see your model, fam? Sit in there. Let's see. I bet like that. I like when you're holding the door. Yeah. And look over there. Way harder with the door is off. No, we're gonna go back to 400. What? Ah, 
So I switched back because we're not really into deep shadows and I do want those shadows to really show. So I brought it back to F16 at 400th of a second. Yeah, I think that's gonna be good and I think that was really good judgment. Look what I'm doing to your camera. <laughs> <laughs> Treat her right. <laughs> Yo, you don't have to touch this, no? No. It's oh, on the land. Tough. It's oh. on the land, so you just have to use everything on here. Oh my god. So, like, we're at a second location. I'm actually going to shoot Marcus here. It's just really cool, industrial looking. So, I just seen it literally, and I just stopped because, like, it was really good. It looked really, really dope. So. We're gonna do it over here. But I'm gonna finish the the, the warm-up shot because I really wanna get straight to shooting Marcus. Um, I'm gonna do a couple more portraits because I need to like get in tight and get used to being uh, tight with the photos and stuff. So we're gonna re-meter for the inside right now. That's 11 and 20 for 250. All right, so I'm at 11 and 250. I'm gonna take this portrait right here. That was fire, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was so good. That was so good. I didn't even know what to do. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. What am I going to do with myself? Okay. <laughs> hey. That was fire, too. I really like this. I'm really liking this area. Whatever area this is, I, I wanna come back in this area. Somewhere around Wilson. I'm gonna rotate the back. Okay guys, so I will admit something that um, the RZ is a lot easier to use. That is a simple fact. Like, the RZ is a lot simpler to use. Shooting experience is a lot faster as well. I'm not feeling that. Nah. <laughs> nah. I don't want to, like, waste photos, you know? I don't want to like waste them. Oh, okay. I like these shadows right here. Oh yeah, this is it. Right, that was fire. That was really good. So. Oh, it's done. So you just gotta keep cranking, right? Yep. Yeah, it's all done. First impressions, guys. The camera is a lot easier, I will say. Um, I enjoyed using it. I enjoyed using the RZ because it's a lot lighter. It's a lot simpler in terms of like functionality. That's a fact. It's smooth, it's smooth. The viewfinder is really bright, but compared to the RB, I still will go with the RB because it's cheaper obviously um and it's a mechanical camera this one it feels like plastic it feels like if i drop it it's gonna shatter into a thousand pieces rb is like a lot tougher it's a lot stronger it still has bellow focusing just like the rb so like personally i'll still go with the rb because the longevity of it is gonna be a lot longer this is electronical so mechanical of electronical any day in my opinion so given that they have the same functionalities it is definitely a lot better so RZ still is really good easier to use um, I guess that's, that goes with the same price point right easier to use functionality lighter and all that type of stuff and it looks sexier look at it, it looks so beautiful it looks like Q says it looks really lovely yeah it looks super lovely I fancy the thing yeah I really fancy it Viewfinder is mighty bright, yeah. Look at this. Look, look through it. Super bright. I fancy this. This is really nice, yeah. But um, that's about it for the video. You already know what it is. It's your boy Shaggy. I'm going to go wash this at home, so 
Um, I don't know if I'm gonna record that process, but I might, so yeah. This is. Hope you guys loved that video because it was super fun at recording. I know I did say there was gonna be a second part of me developing the film, but I'm going to actually leave that for another video. So it's already recording and all that type of stuff, but it didn't make sense dropping it in there because it was just me developing. So I do have another video that's gonna tie into me developing films. So that video is gonna be coming really, really soon. And I also did record a second video on the same day, like literally like five minutes after. And and I'm super excited for that one because it's a lot more serious and a lot more like technical. So do watch out for that. It's probably gonna drop on Sunday. And I'm gonna address something else as well. I am still reviewing all your Instagrams. For the last video that I did, I'm gonna queue up here saying that I'm going to feature um, my favorite photographers from the comments that have 2,000 2, followers and under. So if you wanna enter, do visit the link, the queue that I did up here um, just a couple minutes ago and go enter if you have 2,000 followers and under but you have really good, incredible work. I'd love to make a video on you if I love your work. So last announcement guys is that I am featured in a fundraiser that is including a bunch of film photographers on YouTube that you guys love, such as Willem, Matt Day, Vincent, uh, Joe Greer, and Corey, and a whole bunch of people that are really awesome. We all joined together. Um, shout out to Kyle. He's the one that put it all together. Shout out to him. And we are all selling prints to fundraise so that we could donate to like Black Lives Matter or whatever fundraiser that we choose to be fit, but it will be towards Black Lives. So that's gonna be, that's really awesome. I'm gonna put the link down down below if you don't know about it already but with that being said um, if you really love this video give it a big thumbs up if you didn't give it a thumbs down so if you really like my review of the RZ comment down below and let me know what you think and let me know if I missed anything or if you want me to touch on anything about the RZ comment down below and let me know and if you guys really love the new videos that are gonna be coming out soon comment down below as well and let me know but with that all being said guys I'm super super thankful and grateful but uh, last but not least, follow me on Instagram at shopbyshingy. Check out my portfolio at shopbyshingy.com and check out my merch if you really want to support me. It's weightbetterco.com. Um, I saw shirts that say shoe film and I'm going to start selling my prints as well on there. So do check it out. The link is all going to be in the description down below. And last but not least, follow and hashtag at WePhotoGods if you want me to check out your work and to potentially repost you on the Instagram that I'm talking about that features you guys and is made for you guys and it's made for your growth pretty much and yeah check that out but I'm super grateful thank you to everybody that supports me I love you you guys are so incredible my DMs are now open once again so if you want to DM me and to just chat I will take a couple of days to respond because I'm really really busy I will respond at some point it might take a couple of days it might take a week but I will respond but with that being said thank you guys again for tuning in I love you you guys are awesome. Don't